वेलकम टू द इमरान अकेडमी आई एम डिस्कसिंग विद यू जनरल मैथमेटिक्स ऑफ टेंथ क्लास यूनिट सिक्स मेट्रिस एंड डिटर्मिनेंट्स एक्सरसाइज सिक्स पॉइंट टू एंड टूडे आई एम गोना स्टार्ट विद क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एंड द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इज आइडेंटिफाई ऑल रो मेट्रिस The matrices from the following. Identify all row matrices from the following. If A equals three, four, five. equals 1436 c equals E F G D equals three four one. Seven six nine five two eight and F is equal to one three. Four seven six three so uh, we want to just identify which of these are row matrices as we know a row matrix has only one row uh, if i see these matrices closely i can see that this matrix a has only one row this matrix c has only one row so the row matrices are A and C. So that is the end of this question. Question number five is question number five is also same.
identify all column matrices if now the matrices are a B C D E and F So we are to identify only the column matrices. Here we can see that A has only one column, C has only one column and E has only one column. So column matrices are equal to A C and E so this is the answer to this problem Let's move to the next question. Question number six. Identify all column column matrices if now we start A is given as 1, 2, 3, 2. B is given as 3, 4, 5, 6, 
थ्री वन सेवन माइनस टू सिक्स थ्री एंड फोर फाइव फोर नेक्स्ट इज सी इच इज वन टू नाइन नेक्स्ट मैट्रिक्स इज डी सेवन सिक्स एट एंड फाइव then i have e three five seven then i have f which is ac and bd now i want to just mention column matrices so the column matrices are equal to the matrices having only one column so this c has only one column so c is the answer let's move to the next question question number 7 identify all 3 by 3 square matrices if a equals 213 minus 356 64 minus 3 b equals 247 c equals 734 so here you can see that this matrix has row 1 row 2 and row 3 3 three rows column 1 column 2 and column 3 so matrix a is the only matrix square matrix which has 3 by 3 order so order of a is equal to 3 by 
order of b is it has three rows and it has only one column so order of b is 3 by 1 if i see this one order of c is it has only one row but it has c1 c2 c3 three columns so order of c is it is order of c is 1 by 3 so clearly you can see that this is the one that uh, is our answer so the answer is a with this we come to the end of this exercise in the next lecture in the next lecture i'll cover addition and subtraction of matrices so take care and goodbye please do like share and subscribe the imran academy for more lectures in the future also hit the bell icon thanks once again till the next lecture it's goodbye